I don't like to call it like a spoof because I think I think what we've been able to do with uh, parody over the years is we've been able to change it up. Um, it, 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 there's always those classic kind of movies. We have a different kind of formula, so I just do a, an original take and an original version of what I deem as a funnier take on a movie. And um, it's not about bashing the movie, but I just see opportunities for a lot of jokes where they left a lot of things on the table and I just go, oh man, this kind of character, especially coming from an urban perspective, I think it's a, 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 a lot of fun to be had. So, you know, I, I, if I didn't take my audience would like it, I wouldn't do it. Um, and I'm, I'm hoping that uh, we could, look, I like sex and I like comedy and I do my movies. I, I always find a way to do the two. So I was just like, this is a fun way for me to kind of uh, bring me to uh, a specific movie and make it funny and make it funny to both men and women, make it a really funny date woman or date movie for hopefully uh, 2015, um, uh, 2016 um, Valentine come out and uh, uh, just take uh, and do what the way they did Fifty Shades of Grey. We just gonna do the urban flip and do Fifty Shades of Black. It gotta be a better, better storyline than, than, than the original, uh, but <laughs> we can, it'll, it'll be uh, pretty kind of derivative. They gave us a lot to work with. Now it's about us, you know, going in there and doing the work and finding fun, some fun characters and changing it up and adding that flavor that I do. And hopefully, uh, appeals to my audience and hopefully it appeals to the audience that's a fan it, it, it's supposed to extend to people that are fans of the movie not just people that hated the movie but people that love the movie and if you do it right you you get both audiences and 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 that's the whole purpose of it it's an homage to the to the film and uh, to the book and it was a huge series and you know i hope to find the same success that we did when we took uh uh, the Don't Be a Menace Flavor, and then we added to a scary movie, which was a bigger kind of genre, a bigger movie, and you get kind of bigger results. Uh, look, I just do it because I love it. I do it because I have a take. I do it because I'm inspired, and I sit there and go, oh, you know what would be funny? And I don't do it for money. It's not, not about money. Money's a byproduct of your hard work, your dedication to, you know, to your journey. I love being silly. I love cracking jokes. I love finding, I find jokes at funerals. So for me, it's just sharing love and sharing, you know, uh, my crazy brain with the world. So I think it's a really funny script that me and Rick Alvarez wrote. And we're gonna populate it with some really fun people. And we're gonna bring you a movie that, you know, delivers um, in a way that I, I know my audience likes. You know, I, I, I you, you feed people what you know they love. I ain't gonna cook you some, some shit unless I know that you, you like the shit. You like shit? Oh, you gotta taste some garlic shit. Um, well, hopefully this this one will be good shit. And um, every every time out, I, I really try my best and I put my, my myself on the line in terms of my commitment. I sweat, I bleed, I tear. I don't uh, disappoint myself in terms of what I put out. Um, hopefully over the years, it's the consistency that one day it bubbles out to a point to where, you know, everybody goes, I, I really like what that guy's doing. Um, and for those that don't like it, you know, I don't know what to tell you, but look at all these people that's like it. Um, I don't do it for the, for, for the haters, I do it for the fans. One day you make the haters fans and that's when, you know, it all comes together. But I'm, I'm fueled by love. I'm, fueled by inspiration, fueled by um, my desire to make people laugh, and that's all. I, I just want to be uh, funny.